Hello and welcome to this short clip going through a quite applied uh, multiple choice titration question. So first of all, let's have a look at what it asks. It asks you to work out which statement is correct. So where would you begin with something like this? I definitely recommend looking at where you can work out the moles of something. So it looks to me like we've got the volume and the concentration of H3PO4. Now the correct answer is actually A. So let's work backwards and see why that is. So first of all, looking at the data we're given, we can work out the number of moles of H3PO4 that's used is 5 times 10 to the minus 3. So if we multiply that by 3, then that gives us 0 0.015 moles of NaOH used up. Now notice it says used up. And then it says, after titration, the final solution contains 0 0.015 moles of Na3PO4. But we just said that the NaOH is 0 0.015 moles. There's a bit of confusion going on here. And um, what they're doing is giving you the right amount, but they're saying another of the two species. So question uh, part C is no good. And... After titration, the final solution contains 0 0.0151 moles of H2O. Well, that's the amount that's made, but thinking about a solution, the water is massively in excess in the solution to start with. So therefore, those two answers are no good. Let's look at this one here. So the end point occurs when 75 centimetres cubed of NaOH has been added. So let's have a look we've got 0 0.6 moles per decimeter cubed NaOH. We have, in that answer, possibly 75 centimeters cubed of NaOH. We can work out the number of moles that that represents. That represents 0 0.045 moles. It's three times as much as we actually used up. So unfortunately, that means part B is no good either. So hopefully this gives you a little bit of insight into how you can eliminate wrong answers. It's not one of the multiple choice questions where two obviously wrong answers are, are straight in front of you. You've got to work your way through all of them. So this is the kind of multiple, multiple choice question where you've got to take a little bit of thought and put it into each of the options until you find the correct one. Okay, thanks for listening. Until next time, see you soon.